Hello everybody, welcome to Comics and More. Today, we are going to find an app which mirrors a scientific calculator. As far as I know, there is only one app that really mirrors a scientific calculator. And we are going to look at it today. Only here at Comics and More. So that you will not miss the latest from Comics and More, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to get the latest from this channel. To start off, we are going to go to our Google Play Store. And we are going to look at Hyper Scientific Calculator. We are going to look at some of its description. It's an excellent scientific calculator. And let's install it and click accept. Now it's downloading and it, it is now installing. Let's open the app. We okay, got it. So this is the welcome screen we have. Okay, let's try to make some calculations. Let's have 12 times 6. Okay, that's correct. 72. How about fractions? Okay, let's try... I think it's not working in our landscape mode, so we'll try to switch it to uh, portrait mode. Here, let's try to do some fractions. Let's have one half plus. Oh, sorry, um, cancel. Okay, then we will add, okay, let's try to add a mixed fraction, 5 and 1 fifth. Let's try to put 1 on top, and then I cancel this. I'm not so used to this yet, so let's put 5 there. The answer there is 5.7, but let's say we want it as a fraction. So we'll click on this button here, X to E, and then we're going to, let's say, have it as a mixed number or as an improper fraction. So let's try another one. Let's try to see its features. You have two. Let's have some exponents here. 2 cubed or 2 to the power of 3 times 2 to the power of, I'm still getting used to this. Let's try this one. I don't think that's an exponent. So that's 2 to the power of 3 times 2, which is 16. That's correct. I'm trying to find out where we can have exponents here this is 10 to the power of 3 okay, that's also correct that is 16,000 hmm, let me try okay this is the exponent so this exponent here x to the power of y so let's try 2 to the power of 5 let's try to erase this first okay, let's have 2 to the power of 6 multiplied 2 2 to the power of 2 to the power of let's say 1 no not 1 uh, power of 10 and then let's try to see if it can do give the answer as an exponent which is 2 to the power of 16 okay i think it's not yet capable okay here you have the memory storage Okay, so let's try to look at some of its features. 
So here the layout is changed to packet version. Okay, let's head over to settings. Here we have your position, formatting, display. Let's try to reset it. I just want to let it go back to the compact version, which really looks like the scientific calculator. But before that, let's try the expanded mode. Okay, this is suited to high-end tablets or tablets that have really big resolutions. So... Let's try to go back to compact mode because that is, I think, the most or the easiest way to look at a calculator. Okay, let's try to look at the themes here. You have the classic shades of gray, brushed metal, deep ocean, and the other one there. Let's try to have this brushed metal theme. Okay, now this really looks like my old calculator. Okay, let's try to look at some other features here. If you have the money, you can also upgrade to the Pro version, which costs a little bit higher than a dollar. Okay, so that's it. That is the best scientific calculator app in Android uh, according to the research I've made. And it really looks like the scientific calculator most students use in college or in high school. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. If you have questions or clarifications, leave them in the comments down below. And please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching.